Githurai Kiambu County will be President William Ruto's first stop tomorrow as he begins his first five-day official tour of the Mount Kenya region since assuming office. In Kiambu, Ruto will launch a water supply project expected to serve over half a million residents in the areas of Ruiru, Kahawa, Githurai and Mwihoko. This agenda uh, will keep on repeating and reiterating, as the President says, prioritizes bringing down the cost of living, eradicating hunger, creating jobs, expanding the tax base, improving our foreign exchange balance and promoting inclusive growth uh, through interventions in five core sectors of agriculture, MSMEs uh, development, uh, housing and settlement, universal health coverage, and uh, digital superhighway and creative economy. State House spokesperson Hussein Mohammed, while outlining the president's itinerary, has revealed that President Ruto will chair two meetings with Mount Kenya leaders on Sunday and Tuesday, as well as chair a cabinet meeting from the Sagana State Lodge in Nyeri. 454,168 bags of subsidized fertilizers were distributed in the counties of Nyeri, Muranga, Kiambu, Kirinyaga, Meru, Tharakanidhi, Embu, Nyandarwa, and Laikipia at a cost of almost 1.5 billion, covering various value chains, uh, including tea, coffee, and rice, among others. On this tour, the president will launch the construction of affordable housing units in Kirinyaga and Kiambu, as well as a modern milk processing facility at the Kenya Cooperative Creameries in Kiganjonyeri County, before concluding his five-day visit by commissioning the Narumoru Level 4 Hospital Facility in Kieni constituency. The government has successfully unlocked the delayed funding, and I think the promise from President promised this. Uh, they, he has unlocked the delayed funding of about 82 million USD dollars from the Polish government, and this will go to mechanization, including provision of coolers for farmers across the country, uh, establishment of liquid nitrogen plants across the country, facilitating access to cheaper AI services. Local residents awaiting the president want his administration that they so wholeheartedly voted in to launch new projects that will spur economic development in the region. Iso barabara atu, uh, fikiria juu yaso, juu isita tufuguria biashara. Na isita shikanisha counties, isi sigine, diyo shakura shijaye. Tunamukaribisha hapa nyeri na mauti Kenya, na kikuja akuji na chodwa basho kimebebana, akuji na pesa nyingi, afugue miladi, ajege maudem pa, ma, 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 mabawa pare, ili ukurima ukue unisawa. Sababu kieni, diyo, 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 diyo nini basket ya, ya nyeri county. Nyeri leaders while welcoming the president to Mount Kenya, say that this visit will give them an opportunity to engage the head of state ahead of the looming talks with the opposition. I believe that the talks are not about uh, splitting the government because it will defeat the whole purpose of democracy. If it means changing our constitution to have a hybrid system whereby all those offices are entrenched in the constitution, I think to me it will be better than every other time you know, having talks. So. And as a region, we will not in any way, of course, entertain any other person to come and disrupt the agenda of this government, particularly through uh, what they are calling inclusivity in, uh, in the talks that they are proposing. There is nothing about handshake, there is nothing about bringing Raila in government, because we cannot do that. As we are focused on development, our roads, our water projects, electricity, market, schools, that's what we'll be discussing with the president. We therefore to tell the president, if there is indeed any discussion that is going to take place, it must not be about power sharing, because that would be mockery of democracy, it would be abuse of processes. Kamau Mwangi K24 at the Sagana State Lodge, Nyeri County.